In this video, you'll see how to configure session permissions using Run As in AWS System Manager Session Manager. With Run As, you can control access, set preferences, and define users for Linux instances. First, let's review the launching of a session using default permissions. To get started, let's navigate to the Amazon Elastic Compute Cloud, or EC2, management console to make sure we have an EC2 instance running Linux. As you can see, we have a Linux instance that is running. Next, let's go to IAM to confirm that the role attached to this instance has the permissions required to manage EC2 with Systems Manager. The policy attached to this role allows an instance to use Systems Manager Service Core functionality, which are the necessary permissions. Now, let's navigate to Session Manager to connect to the instance. The Linux instance shows up in Session Manager, indicating it is being correctly managed by Systems Manager. Let's start a session to connect to the instance. We've connected to the instance using default settings. Let's check the user account for the session. By default, sessions are launched using the credentials of a system-generated SSM user account. With this account, the system does not prompt for a password when executing root-level commands. To improve security, you can instead launch sessions using the credentials of an operating system account. Let's create two new user accounts, one administrator account and one standard user account. By default, neither user has root privileges. Let's give the Linux admin user these privileges. This command adds the Linux admin to the file, which grants the user root privileges. Now let's terminate this instance and look at how we can use run as to set Linux user as the default user account. First, go to the Preferences tab to configure user session privileges. Click Edit to see the options. Enabling Run As support allows you to launch sessions using specific operating system user accounts instead of the system generated account. Let's enable Run As support for Linux instances. Session Manager provides two methods for specifying the user account that is used to start sessions. You can specify an operating system username here in Preferences or tag an IAM user or role. Here we'll set the default to Linux user, which will start sessions with this account. Now that the preferences have been updated, let's start a new session. Let's check the user account used to launch this session. The user account is now Linux user instead of the SSM user. Let's check the privileges associated with Linux user. As expected, the user cannot run sudo commands. Now let's terminate the session and use the second method to define a run as user. To get started, return to the IAM management console to specify the operating system user account. As an administrator, you can tag each user or role in IAM with a Linux user with the desired permissions. Let's add a tag to the admin user role. We'll add the AWS provided key SSM session run as and the Linux admin username as the value. Tags added to a user or role will take precedence over any default user set in the session manager preferences. When starting a new session, session manager will first look for a tagged IAM user account and then it will check the preferences. Now let's return to Session Manager to start a new instance and verify the user role. As you can see, we are appropriately logged in as the Linux admin user, even though the default user remains defined as Linux user in preferences. As expected, the Linux admin user account has full sudo access and can update the system application repositories. You've just seen how to configure session permissions using Run As in AWS Systems Manager Session Manager. Thanks for watching. Now it's your turn to try.